Welcome back, everybody. It's time for interactive problem number eight. Uh, so in this hand, we open one no trump. This is from a duplicate game that I played. I open one no trump with the south hand. Partner used the Texas transfer, uh, transferred me to four spades, and so here I am in four spades. Uh, if you've never heard of Texas transfers, it's a very commonly played convention. It was just a second type of transfer when you're just going straight to game. So go ahead and hit the play button on the side of the page, play the hand out, and then come back and watch the video. Okay, so this is actually a really common theme. Uh, you've probably seen these problems in books. It's fun to see it at the table. You just kind of got to recognize it. Uh, when we're playing in four spades, uh, first of all, a com if, we're, if you're a loser counter, some people like to count losers, some people like to count winners. It's a good idea usually to do both. Uh, but in trump contracts, I tend to focus on my loser count. But it's very important you do that from the long trump hand side it's much easier to count your losers from the long trump hand side and it's, it's funny when you're when you play transfers it's commonly the situation where you're playing the hand as the shorthand in trumps but you really need to kind of look from dummy's perspective uh so uh here we are we're, we're counting our losers from the north hand on this heart lead we have one heart loser up there one club loser and we have two diamond losers now, we can see some destinations for some of our losers. We might be able to use the king of clubs to throw one of our diamonds away. We have, we have potential to get rid of one more of our losers from our hand, and that is by establishing the club suit. So, uh, you know, when you're, when you're counting your losers and you know you have a heart loser, you know you have a club loser, and you probably have two diamond losers, you can see you're going to get rid of one of your diamond losers on the king of clubs. The question is, you got to be hungry. How can I get rid of another loser? And that's with the club suit. The club suit, we have six of them, five, one, but that means the opponents have seven of them. So if, the, if there are seven of them break four, three, then uh, we, 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 our last club eventually could be good. But there's, it's going to take work to get that club to be good. We have to knock out the ace. That's going to be once we have to play clubs. Then we're going to have to trump a club. Then we're going to have to trump a second club. And then we're going to have to get back to dummy to enjoy the last club. So we're going to need to get to dummy a bunch of times. So that, that, that the trick to this hand was entry management. So let's watch how we do it. So uh, on the heart lead, uh, it's... It's, it's very important that we don't duck the first trick. And why is it important that we don't duck the first trick? Because if we do duck the first trick, uh, what's going to happen is it, a, a good opponent might shift to a diamond. I think the robots would shift to a diamond. And once they shift to a diamond, now there's actually nothing we can do. We're going to knock out the ace of clubs, but they're going to get to cash that diamond too quickly. So it was critical at trick one that we win the ace of hearts. Now, before we even draw trumps, you could actually afford to play one round of trumps over to the king. But the, the problem is we need to look at our entries. We're going to need to get to dummy. As we said, we got to get there to rough one club. That's going to need one entry. We're going to need to rough a second club. That's going to need a second entry. And then we're going to need to get back there. So we need to get back there three times. Do we have three entries to dummy? We do. We have the ace of diamonds. We have the ace of spades. And we have that beautiful little five of spades because we have a ten-card spade fit. That five of spades is going to be an entry. But we've got to be efficient right now. Use all three of those entries the ace five of spades and the ace of diamonds uh so we're gonna play the queen of clubs before drawing a second round of trumps and they are gonna win the ace they're probably gonna cash a heart and then they're gonna say hey let's get diamonds going but we're gonna say no we have an answer to that we win the ace we trump a club might as well trump it high don't risk getting over roughed then we cross over to the ace of spades and now with all the trumps gone, we might as well just play king of clubs, throwing one diamond, and a club rough, and let's be careful about what we rough with. We need that three of spades, and there, and finally, we get to go across to the five of spades, and our club is good right there so we get rid of our diamonds so there's a common theme five one fits can sometimes the five card suit can sometimes be set up i'm going to show that to you one more time uh, and by the way if you're counting tricks on this hand it could work too you see you have seven spade tricks and a club is eight and a heart is nine and a diamond is ten and where's our 11th trick coming from? It's coming from the club suit. So that's another way of looking at it. In fact, maybe in this case, it's even easier to just count your tricks. Seven spades, 
One heart, one club, one diamond is ten. Where can we get another trick from? And the only answer is in the club suit. So I'm going to watch one more time on that heart lead. You can see with, with the clubs wide open, uh, it goes to the queen and ace. We play a spade over to our king. Might as well draw one trump. We play the queen of clubs out of our hand. They cash a heart. They shift to a diamond. We win. You can see that the, the clubs are splitting. So we go club, rough. We might as well rough high, not get over roughed. And then spade back to dummy's ace. We play king of clubs, throwing a diamond. A club. And trump with the eight so that we keep that three of spades to come across to the five and get our 11th trick and, or get rid of our extra loser. All right, hope you enjoyed the hand. Uh, see you guys next time.